So right now I'm we're doing um, a reading on what do we need to know today? What is it that we need to know today? What we need to know is that we are have we're in hostilities. We're in an environment where there are a lot of there's a lot of discontent. And in this discontent, we start picking on the things that are closest to us. We pick on the people that are near us. We pick, we pick on the people that are closest to us. We pick on the people who we meet, uh, that we work with, the people that we meet in the grocery stores, the people that we meet when we're shopping or just driving along in the along in the um on the street and that is because we are in and we are attached to the narrative we have not separated ourselves from what people say what we are told is going on we know what we are told is going wrong on is not right we know instinctively that what is going on is not right and that creates the the hostility within us, the hostility that we feel. That we feel and we cannot pinpoint what it is. It's the. It is the. Knowing that we're being lied to. So what can we expect for the next coming, the next few days? What can we expect coming out in the next few days? The We should expect a more, um, the, a better ability to think and to lead from our hearts. That is what we need. That's what the next coming days are going to, that we can kind of expect to be seen. We want to be able to trust ourselves. We want to be able to experience through from our hearts. And, and in doing that, we need to kind of step back and we need to start thinking, thinking about how we go about doing that. Instead of being all tied up, in our in the narrative we need to stand firm and start thinking for ourselves think out of the think outside the box think outside of the um the the energy that we that's being forced on us the uncertain energy that's being forced on us because it really is being forced on us and in this trans and transition of starting to to start thinking to stop being all tied up in the emotions of everything we need to speak from our hearts after we sit, step back and we think about it and what is unexpected is that from within we find the strength we find the strength to to stand up we find the strength to to trust ourselves we find the strength to recognize what is wrong and where that message is coming from and so we can dissect that message and say oh okay well it's just a manipulation technique <laughs> a manipulation tack tact then we all then can look forward to being able to stand in our own heart strength and in our own ability to think to think clearly to trust our hearts and from that point forward we are given the world in essence we are given the energy to stand to stand firm in our life and know that we are that everything is going to work out Yes, we have been told uh, things are going to work out. 
we have been told for years and years and ages and months and years and ages that everything's going to work out. And we're coming to the point where with our patients and with a strategy so that, that where we're trusting our heart and where we are expressing ourselves from a thoughtful position and with the patients that we have been giving, we've been very patient. We are, we are getting, we are getting the world. We are getting all that we, all the good things that we have been waiting for. So for the next few days, just trust, trust yourself. Step away from at being attached to the drama. Because hostilities only set us back. Get into the more thinking mode out instead of the emotional mode. Don't be tied down to, to uh, expectations. And know that the, that the patience, the strategy, the all of the the trust that you have been wanting to give to yourself, you can give to yourself without uh, thinking you're going to have a, get a slap in the face, get blindsided, stuff like that. You will, with the ben- with the patience, you will begin to start seeing the signs that you. <clears throat> The things that you have been wanting will really be able to come to you in a more easy and satisfying way instead of through drama, which is the resistance. That's all I have for us today. Thank you so much for stopping in. Please like and share my video. And as usual, stay tuned because there is a lot more to come.